Hello, Dr. David Bashore, board certified dermatologist here at Balcones Dermatology and Aesthetics. Part three of this series of three about the upper face. We're going to talk about the temples. Temples are very important. It's not always noticed by people as something that needs to be treated, but I'll show you in a picture in somebody that doesn't have any problems with this area. The temples are, it's right here. So it's right in this area. And what happens is, is that we age, this will lose volume. Um, with loss of volume in the temples, what actually happens is that eyebrow will actually start to sag too. What you can notice is that when, let me show you here, when we age, what happens is that temple becomes more noticeable. You can see in this picture from my anatomy book from medical school, that as the temple becomes more noticeable, it does age us. It becomes, a, it's a skeletonized look. It's one of those things that people notice because when people get filler done and it's uneven on the rest of their face. You can tell, gosh, something just doesn't match. And it's because a lot of people get filler out here on their cheeks and they don't do anything in the temple. And it's when things look une uneven across the face, you notice that things look different. So all part of the Austin natural look is that we wanna maintain that everything looks the same age. You don't wanna look 60 here and 30 here. So that's important. When you look at this uh, model in this picture, which her temples are perfect, is a difference between male and female uh, temples. Female, it's okay to be a little bit concave for it to go in just a little bit. If you fill it all the way out and make it prominent on a temple, it's very masculine. So we gotta be real careful that we don't do too much for women for that area. But just a little bit can help in just about everybody. That's one of those places that a lot of people don't think about treating and it does get undertreated. but by treating here, it gives you more even overall face appearance and then you can achieve what people refer to as the uh, ideal face shape is that you maintain that oval around the outside. Um, so we want to make sure that everything matches. So if we do the cheeks, we, you know, if the temples aren't treated, it's going to stand out. So all part of the Austin natural look. Thanks for watching. And that was the end of series three for the upper face.